Okay, so we're going to solve our first equation here. Step one, get it equal to zero, already taken care of. Remember, the x squared needs to be positive. Step two, factor it. So I'm going to, now that we've done all the factoring, I'm going to stop showing as many factoring steps. All right, the signs need to be different. They need to multiply to 72. They need to add to negative one. All right, after I play around here, I'm going to end up with eight and nine. I'm going to need a negative nine. That'll give me negative one. All right, so that's going to be x plus 8, and x minus 9 equals 0. Okay, I set each of these equal to 0. So I'm going to show this for a lot of the stuff that I do. Sometimes I'll just talk about how you can do a shortcut way to do this. Okay, yeah, so that's going to end up giving me x equals negative 8. When I move 8 to their side, this is going to end up giving me x equals 9 when I move the 9 to their side. All right, so I've got those two answers, and I'm covered.